Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back and today we're going to Lost City of Tinos. So this level starts where previous one ended. And the only way where I can go is this way. This switch opens the door below me and I'm gonna go there, but first I wanna get a rocket. That door is a return path here, so I'm gonna open it, but I won't come back here anymore. That door acts like a shortcut if you get stuck here. Okay, so this is the door that we just opened, and here we have a key. This is the shortcut door that I just mentioned. Before we go this way, there's a switch here. This is one of the two switches that I have to pull so that something happens in that room that the camera just showed us. Pulling this switch will open this door and it will also spawn those ladders in that room. This ladder. So here we have a puzzle. There are some arrows there, going from top to bottom. And on top we have a human. In the middle we have an animal, and on the bottom we have a plant. So this is like a food chain puzzle. The human eats an animal, and the animal eats a plant, so that is true. Human eats birds or hunts birds, and birds eat fish. That is true. Humans eat plants, but plants don't eat animals. This switch is false. Humans eat fish, but fish don't eat birds. Here we have human hunting birds, and birds eating plants. That is true. And that opens a gate. So that's first two and the last one. Another way how you can look at this puzzle is if you try to compare who has higher intelligence. Over here we have a tricky secret to get. Because it involves mosquitoes. Uh. 
and the secret is located in their nest. You can try to kill them until they stop spawning, but I'm going in. So I'm gonna save here. Now here are some invisible platforms. From this one, you wanna take step back and just jump forward. And then there is another one this way. You can see it there. So from here you can do standing jump. Now I'm gonna equip my Desert Eagle and go in the nest. Get the Desert Eagle clips. And a small med pack. From here I can do a standing jump and then roll on the platform. And now from here... We can jump here and fall down, take a little fall damage. Or go back using the same path that got us here and take no fall damage. And I'm gonna go with that. Over here to the left is a small med pack. And now we can go this way. Now we are gonna face a new type of enemy. They take 7 shots from Desert Eagle. Over here we have a fire trap. And then I like to go to the left. To the left is an arena that's gonna spawn even more mutants. And here I like to use my rocket launcher because we get an awesome music. The next cage that's gonna open is the right one. And the final one is left one. In the last cage is a switch. The switch raised that platform.
Now, there are a couple of platforms down there that we have to raise with a switch over here and switch over there. They raise some platforms, but also lower others. So now I have to pull them, but later I'm gonna have to switch one of them off. So the platform that we raised is this one. This will raise a platform above us. This one. And as soon as we pull this switch, we want to jump to the left. Now we want to go back up. And turn back one of those two switches. Why? Because then they will raise this platform and then we can go there. We raised that platform below the bridge with that switch. Now here I'm gonna save, because I want to show you two things. One of the ways to fall down is to jump from here and just tap the action button. And she will slide down here. Another way to do it... Here you want to tap backwards and fake grab the ledge so that she can slide onto that platform. And by fake grab, I mean just hold the action button for a bit and then let go so that she doesn't grab the ledge. This switch opened that door down below. It also raised this platform, which will allow us to climb here. And this switch opens a door to the second secret of the level, which is a timed door. You see that water down below? I'm gonna use the same trick on it like I did on the bridge, with a fake air grab so that I can slide right into the water. So from here you wanna hold the action button and she will slide in the water. And now we have to hurry because that secret has a timed door. 
There is a key in this area that we have to get, but I'm gonna come back and get it later. The key that I mentioned goes in this keyhole, and it will help us end the level. <laughs> this is where I came from, if you remember these traps. And the secret is just below this bridge. If you get trapped inside, you can open the door with this switch. Okay, left is where I went before, and right is where I came from to get a secret. But right, I have some unfinished business. The last secret is up there. And I'm gonna go get it right away. So here I have four paths that I can take, and eventually I'm gonna have to take all of them. So we have four rooms with elements. The one on the left is wind, the one over there is fire, the one on the right is water, and there's an earth one here. And to get the final secret, I'm gonna have to go into the earth one. You don't have to take the Earth one first, it doesn't matter which one you take first, but the Earth one has something to do with the secret. I chose to go to the right in the Earth room because it's safer for a Nomad Pack run, but you can also go to the left.
For the last secret, I have to stand on this platform and then jump over here. Then jump here. Here we have a switch and a small med pack. And here we have a first mask. So, I'm gonna save. And pick it up. Picking up the mask will enrage the room. It's gonna cause ceiling to fall. From here you could jump on that platform below, but that's gonna make you take some damage, which is something I don't want to do now, so I'm gonna take the normal path. Down here is a pit of death, so what I like to do is jump on that slope. The next platform will cause ceiling to fall, so I like to hop back, grab the ledge. And now here, the next one will also cause a ceiling to fall. So I'm going for the hole to avoid it. And then we have some ladder here. Over here to the right we have some Desert Eagle clips. hallways that you see here are exits from rooms with elements. Now where's that guy? Now I'm gonna go back here, get the key.
Now I'm gonna go get the third and final secret. I won't use the key right away, because I want you to see what it does. So I will use it later. Over here is a fire trap, and I'm afraid that this wasp will push me into it. Trust me, it happened before. And here we have a large med pack. Okay, so now we have to go back to other rooms with elements. And let's go with, uh, with the wind one. So I'm gonna save. Now the wind one is a maze. If you want to leave as quickly as possible, just follow the wind. But, there are some pickups here, so, one of them is this way, here we have Uzi Clips, the easiest way to get the pickups on the left side of the maze is just to follow the left wall. Over here is a movable block. And here we have some flares and a small med pack. And over here we have some shotgun shells. And now we are done with the left part of the maze. So now... We have to go back to the entrance. There's the entrance. On the right side of the maze, to get to loot and to leave, the easiest way is to follow the right wall. This is a dead end, this is a dead end, but here we can get a small med pack. And now follow the right wall again. And if you just follow it, to the right is the exit, but this way, you can get grenades. Here we have uh, spiked traps. You don't want to go down, we want to go up. Jump to the right, jump to the left, then do the same thing here. If you want to trigger that trap, you can take one step forward, or I guess two, and that's it.
We got the second mask. Okay, now the third one, fire one. If you stand on this block, you will get a cool camera angle. And if you light up a flare, you can see on which tiles you can stand. The X is where Lara is. This is the first one where we can stand. And then that one over there is the second one. You see that large med pack over there? You see how that tile has fire? When you jump on this one here, this one has a pressure plate that's gonna turn off that fire. So, look at the large med pack and shotgun shells. Hop back, run and jump, pick them up, and jump backwards. And now the same thing, but this time we wanna go left. And over here is a large med pack with a trap. Now, this large med pack is unreachable, but there is a way to reach it. By glitching. So if you just jump like this, you can eventually get it. And if the game pushes you back, you can explore what's behind, nothing. And then you can just glitch back. But... I'm not gonna do that. Now down here we have some heads that are breathing fire. So what I like to do here is watch the head animation and count the movements. So one, two, three. And after three, pull up, run and jump and grab. Okay, same with this one. One, two, three. Jump to the right side. This will turn off the final head. And now jump back, grab the ledge, count the animation, one, two, three, and then run and jump to the right. Here is another trap. Grab the mask. And now we have three masks. So one more left. Wow, look at this guy. Element of water. So here we have these blades, and this room is all about swimming and timing the blades.
Over here we can get a large med pack. Now these blades, depending on how they hit you, they can either deal a low amount of damage or a high amount of damage. So I'm gonna save. The first hole we want to go into now is the one on the left. The hole on the top has an air pocket, but so does this one. But this one also has a switch that's gonna open a door in the hole on the right. And that door is also timed, so I have to hurry back now. Okay, so now, on the left, there are some Desert Eagle clips. Over there are some Uzi clips. And there's also a lever. The lever will open that door below. Okay, amazing. Now flip this switch. And now we have to go on the other side. First, I'm gonna get some air. Flip this switch so that we can leave. Here we can get some MP5 clips. And now we wanna go into the hole on the bottom. Current will pull us here. And 
that should be it. <sighs> now we want to go to the left. I have four masks and a key. Now I can place all of that. Where's that guy? use the key <laughs> now I'm gonna save again just in case Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.